What is going on guys? Grave here today and I talk about how a lot of people in the community are upset with the seals of the Endeavor system. They feel like we're getting less and less seals each month that the system has been out. And personally, I never really imagined that we were going to be getting enough seals to really be able to buy much throughout the year. If you want a really expensive Radiant Apex, they're usually about 16,000 seals. Most people don't like the idea of having to wait because most of the time the box that you want probably is not going to be out once you get the enough seals so you're going to have to wait until that box is released again and builders really aren't happy with the system in general but i figured it was going to be a very slow system i talked about it when it first came out i thought it was a system to kind of cover uh, bethesda and zos in case they are approached by anyone from some of these you know different countries now that have all the new gambling laws most countries or a lot of countries nowadays consider you know loot crates gambling and a lot of different games have kind of gone to the system of where you can still buy things but at the same time if you log in every day you log in every week you can buy things you know with free currency that you get from logging in and that kind of covers them from you know getting in trouble for you know the game being or the boxes being quote unquote gambling however you kind of look at that i don't know if i consider it gambling or not you know that's kind of everybody's own opinion but I think that's really the main reason Zoss does it. And a lot of other companies have kind of started going with this system as well. And I think over the months, you know, we have noticed that, I think most people have noticed that these seals are getting a less in amount per day, per week. Um, to begin with, a lot of times we were getting 20 seals a day. Uh, sometimes we're getting, or I think at least once, we got 300 seals for the weekly. And that has kind of declined and dropped off. And I think Zoss is trying to get it to that sweet spot where they want it to be. To where they're getting or you're getting so many seals per year and that's pretty much all you're going to get and i still think it's a good system if you're a person that logs in every day uh, logs in every week to do your weekly uh, that way you can get these seals i know a lot of people probably are never going to do it and they probably know that as well they probably realize that most people are not going to be able to do that every single day every single week so they probably still plan on most people buying the majority of the stuff in game with real money from the crown store and it was never really an option, in my opinion, or never really a thing that Zoss wanting to do to completely get rid of people buying crowns because that's how they support the game. You know, if you buy things in game, that's how these companies continue to support the game and put money into the game. And so I, I never really saw it as a, a thing to completely get rid of people purchasing crowns for real, uh, real world money. I just saw it as a thing to kind of cover uh, Zoss and Bethesda from really getting in trouble from anyone saying you know that the loot boxes in their game were going to be considered gambling now i know a lot of people in the community are upset that they're not getting enough crowns i know a lot of people are not enough crowns with not enough seals to buy things from the crown store i know a lot of people are getting upset that the seal rate seems to drop month by month since this has been released when the you know the blackwood chapter came out you know this whole idea of seals of the endeavor everybody was really excited about it and i think that excitement and the newness has kind of died off for the most people in the community and now they're kind of just upset about it and really boasting their opinions overall i don't really see it changing much it would be nice if they would give us enough seals per year to be able to buy at least two radiant apexes or at least one of the more expensive radiant apexes and maybe one of the cheaper i don't think they'll ever do that i think it's going to kind of be this way if you want to get a radiant apex you're pretty much going to have to save up and do your dailies every day and your weeklies every week to be able to get one radiant apex a year and unfortunately, that's kind of just how it's going to be. Like I said, I never thought this was going to be a way to completely get rid of people having to purchase crowns with real money. I think it's just a way for them not to honestly get in trouble. And they're not the only company doing it. A lot of companies are doing this now if they have loot boxes in their game. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community, Discord, my Twitter, and of course, the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. I'll catch you all next time. Peace.